Good morning. Good morning, Your Honor. Y your motor vehicle has been booted. Yeah, I'm just going through a lot right now, to be honest. What's the matter? I'm just, like, just having a lot of personal problems. I'm having somebody stalk me. And just, um, it's just, just homelessness and stuff like that. You're homeless? Yeah. Do you have housing? No. Where do you live? I was going from family member to family member's houses, but um, they just, they only let me stay for so long, and I was just sleeping in my car, so it's just kind of, um, just difficult situation. Your motor vehicle has been booted. It has been. And in addition to that, you have 10 violations. Yeah. Yeah. Are you living in your car? Am I? Yeah. So now you don't even have any place to live because your car was taken. Exactly. Are you working? I just got a job. I was working before. I was actually working um, at Smart Green um, not too long ago, but I was dealing with homelessness and uh, just dealing with a lot of things. And now um, I was jobless for a little while and now I'm working um, at a restaurant. And I was just hoping that I could be able to do some t kind of like payment plan to be able to be able to keep my car and I don't, I don't know if my license is suspended I don't I don't I don't know well you've gone through a lot based on what you're telling me yeah I am how far did you go in school about 12th grade um, I have autism I'm on the spectrum I didn't finish because I just I actually um, had a relationship that that was really difficult on me and, and I just I didn't want to go to school anymore. How long ago was that when you quit school? Um, 2011. Mm -hmm. so. 11 years ago. Yeah. How much can you afford to pay today? Uh, um, I have no, I have like $5 in my pocket. I, I was broke as of last week when my car insurance took the money out of my bank. So I, that's all I have. And I just started my job today. Like I just started my job this week. You have five dollars to your name. Yeah, that's all I have in my purse right now. I'm going to order. It's mandatory. I'm going to order a one hundred dollar boot fee. I'm going to charge you three hundred dollars for the tickets. Thank you so, so much. So you're going to owe four hundred dollars. Three hundred dollars of that will be paid by the Philomena Fund. By what? Philomena Fund is a fund okay. that's named after my mom. It consists of monies that are sent from all over the world for, for the court to use its discretion to help people that are in need. You certainly are in need. So I'm going to use $300 of that fund for your benefit. Thank you. All right. And the boot will be released. You then will owe $100. I'm going to give you one month to pay the 100 If you can't pay it, I want you to come back and see me. And if your circumstances don't change, then I will arrange for that to be paid as well. Thank you so much. Do you understand that? Thank you. So when you leave here today, the boot will be taken off the car. You will have your car. Thank you. Do you have any money to eat? I've, I've been working at the restaurant, so that's how I'm able to live. I've been only eating like one meal a day. Because they give one free meal. Everybody deserves a chance in life. You know, it's easy to be very strict and say, well, I'm sorry, that's it. Right? But I, I try to take people's personal situation into, into account. And I think you've had some challenges that are very difficult to face. And you've been very forthright and very honest about them. And that's why I'm trying to help you. Thank right? you. We're going to also, before you leave, before you leave, we're going to arrange to give you $50 in cash from the Philomena Fund so you will have some money so you can get something to eat. Thank you. For a couple of days. Thank you. You understand that? Thank you. Okay, so before you call, leave the courtroom, I'll make that arrangement for you, okay? Okay. See you, Alyssa. Thank you. You're smiling now. It's better. Yeah. You have something to smile about? Yes, thank you. Okay, you can go. You want, you want to see her? Your Honor, I, I, I play in restaurants um, and I get free food. 
And I play tonight, if you're around, I'm at, at, uh, playing at Adwell's okay. and Napolitano's, and I can give you the free meal that I usually get. Thank you. Thank you so much. You know, she don't eat the cheap meal. She gets the, she gets. Oh yeah, the lobster. Yeah, I don't know if gets, they're gonna go for that. She gets, an, she gets an appetizer. She has a heavy, she, she loves big meals. And then she has dessert. But, okay. <laughs> So I'm a musician, not a magician. We appreciate that. <laughs> what is your name? Giancarlo. I'm Bonnie. Nice Bonnie, to meet nice you. Nice to meet yes. you. Your pleasure. All right. Listen, I'm not joking about homelessness. I know it's a very serious matter. I'm just trying to make you feel comfortable. You understand? And this gentleman is extraordinarily generous. So we want to thank you for that. That's wonderful. That's Giancarlo, right? Thank you so much. You have a good heart. Pleasure. That's what... Life is all about helping others. Okay, now that's half the battle. Okay. You have to do something else. Okay. When things turn around for you, you have to help somebody else, right? That's true, yes. Okay, have a good day. Thank you, you too.